Okay, the third canvas. This is a five by five gallery rack canvas. I'm gonna put my colors down that were inspired by Karen Dershon from Waterfall Acrylics on YouTube. You can find her um, under Waterfall Acrylics and uh, her video that I, I got inspiration for this from was number 383. I'm gonna put as much on this one because it's tiny. This was a Titan Green Pale. This one was a pigment called uh, Parakeet from this little piggy. It's actually not the exact one because, but I made one to look just like it. It's almost a match. That Parakeet might be a little brighter than this one. A little, like more of a yellow, yellowish tone. And this one is a Golden's uh, Fluid Acrylic Phthalo Turquoise. Such a pretty color. I have a sweater this color and I love it. I, I pair it with all, I consider it a neutral. I pair it with something yellow or black or um, purple or stripes. I don't care. Okay, this color is a mock, mocked up um, color for the This Little Piggy pigment powder called Lagoon. It's one of their new colors, and I just haven't gotten around to buying it, but this is pretty close. I used the emerald green pigment, and then I mixed it up and added some uh, Golden's turquoise. This is Golden Fluid Acrylic Iridescent Gold Fine. I think these colors look like a peacock together. This was a brilliant combo that Karen came up with with Waterfall Acrylics. I love her. I learned so much from her. Okay, my last color is a cell activator from Amsterdam Paints. And it's a mix of Amsterdam and Golden. It's like a deep violet color. And I mixed it with the, we call it Rue Juice, which is Australian Floetrol. It is expensive. <laughs> it's like $50 for a liter. It lasts you a while, but man, it's not cheap and you don't want to waste it. I mixed all these paints up last night and then I didn't have time to paint once I had them all mixed up, so I let them sit overnight. But I really hate to let these sit too long, especially with cell activator. Okay, I'm going to move my paints over. And I'm going to blow these with my hair dryer. Um, um, a cool heat. Ooh, look at that go. Right. Okay, Too much purple cell activator on there. Do you have sunscreen? Yeah. Look at all these beautiful cells. Woo! That's that Australian so uh, Floetrol. You can't um, duplicate it as easy as you can get with that Floetrol from Australia. It's just there are there are people that have some success with the American formula, but um, I don't have that same look. And I believe that having fresh mixed cell activator really plays a role. Wow, that's pretty. Okay, I'm gonna give this a spin. Still on screen? Yeah. Okay. Hopefully this doesn't fly off because it's kind of light. It wants to move. I want some of those cells to open up a little. Okay. Wow. Look at those beauties. 
Look at those cells. They're juicy. I want, to, I want it to come this way. I'm going to move it until this, this paint stops moving so much. I got to get some of it off of there. to fluid art you kind of don't know where it's going to take you and this ride was pretty awesome let me get that flow to go down and then we'll come this way and screen hopefully yeah i want this paint to cover this corner So thanks for watching. Here it is. All right, take care.